Uh, I'm going to miss you, buddy. Yes, I'm going to miss you too. But first, Hoff, I'm not going to be working with you anymore. You're going to be before me, so I'm not going to – I'll see you. We'll say hello. We'll chat. But I want to tell you I appreciate you, man. You you help streamline us here because on the national show, we literally did what we wanted to do. <laughs> we had no boss. We just talked about whatever. And you came and you helped us become more focused on how to be – a, a local show. So I want to appreciate you. Dove, um, I'll miss talking Leviticus 19.27 with you. Uh, <laughs> you got to geek out up to the right to the end, don't you? I, I, have, I have an of course, but I have an appreciation for you, for who you are. And, you, I mean, you're unique to this station. He is. Obviously, you've been here forever, but there's not many rabbis that do what you do. And I appreciate that from a historical standpoint, but more importantly, from a people standpoint. Thank you. So I miss working with you as well. Most important. Very nice. But it's true, man. No, absolutely. True. You know, I geek out with, with Dove. I asked him about his hair. Right? Why can't you shave your hair? Because mm-hmm. well, it's in the Bible. Uh-huh. Leviticus 7, 19, 27. I looked at, we talked about it. I, I was in the room. I was so, listening. No, he's, he's, bro, he's the smartest guy here. He really he's is. He's the smartest guy Nobody here. Nobody gives you the credit, Dove. Uh-huh. But I appreciate you. And BT. Yes. I'll be listening to you. Obviously, um, I'm going to miss you for sure. Um, I'm going to still seek out advice from you because there's still some things I don't know locally. Um, but this has been real, dude. It really has. Yeah, man. Um, it's 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 so weird because we're staying here. Mm-hmm. It's not like, you know, one of us got fired yeah. or, you know, a contract was up and it was a more of a, co- a conventional end yeah you know which all often happens in in our business it almost doesn't feel like an end <laughs> that's why i know that's why when, when i was leaving the the house today again my wife said are you sad and because she knows i'm really sentimental yeah, you know that obviously course, too i mean and i said no i said maybe it hasn't hit me maybe i'm just really at a stage in my life where i, I focus on on the good and the happy mm-hmm. rather than maybe lament a few things or fixate on things that i used to it's been an honor, man. It's been an honor riding next to you for a long time. It's been it's been a pleasure and it's been an honor. And um, you know, my it's funny, my dad growing up, my dad's a retired detective, you know that, and he used to talk about some of his old partners, right? Mm-hmm. And he'd always say, you know, so and so, and I know some of the names that I'm not gonna throw them out there, you know, so and so was a good partner, so and so was a good partner. <laughs> and when you're on the job, that's that's pretty much the, the strongest praise you can give anybody. And I would just say that Tiki was a great partner. Thank you. you were, I could trust you. I trusted you the whole time. No doubt. Uh, I respected you, and and I'm happy for you. And, you know, I think in a lot of ways, in, in my own mind, I think if we would have come to WFN a long time ago, which I think many times we both thought that we should have. Definitely should um, have. Who knows where this show would have gone. And and I'm sad that it's ending, but I'm happy for both of us. And you've been, and I mean this, this is going to sound corny, you've, been, you've enriched my life. Um, I think you've made me a better person, better human, a little more grounded, and um, I'm going to miss you, buddy. Yeah. And have a great time with Evan. Don't let him geek. If, listen, I'm going to tell you right now. If, if both you guys geek out, which you both have the propensity to do, the show is going to bomb. <laughs> like, yeah, no, I'm just kidding. I, I like, prob- you can't I, always geek out with I him pro- because you'll get you, lost. I promise you I won't let that help. Uh, and no, and, 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 and uh, throw back to you. Don't scream all day. No, no, that's the thing. It's funny. Everybody's like, "Oh my God, Sal and BT gonna be yelling all day." No, don't scream all no, day. No, it's it, that that I think. And listen, now there will be moments that go viral without us even trying, that's right. and that's what excites me really. And that's the other thing. Maybe that's why I'm not as sad because yeah. I'm happy for you for the new opportunity, and I'm also really enthused about the opportunity that Sal and I both have. Yeah. So. Um, we Change could do is this good sometimes. Yeah, 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 absolutely. And the friendship is is always there, That's right? And the respect is always there. So uh, we could belabor this all day, but there's no need to. I want to say one more thank you. This is very quick to the audience. All right. And again, you know, our 12 years together when we came to the fan, I could not wait to get going. And you know, it was up to you guys to to decide whether or not y- y- you embraced us and whether or not you. You trusted us, and you guys did. So the Tiki and Tierney almost two-year run at WFAN, it was imperative. In my, There was no way I was coming here and failing. Mm-hmm. There was no freaking way that that was happening, and we did it together. Absolutely. I love you. I'll love, miss you, brother. Love you too, bro. 